Hey guys, today I'm gonna um, give you a quick explanation how to connect your uh, Alcatel Link Hub LTE Hub Station uh, to the AT&T uh, SIM card, okay? So, first step, you connect, make sure you're just connected to the power supply and your lights are on, okay? And um, then you go ahead and insert the SIM card into the SIM card slot, okay? So make sure the SIM card, is, uh, the metal part is facing down and the uh, little ha uh, corner, cut corner is on the inside. So that goes first, like this. So basically, you can use something like Sharp to get it all the way in. When it clicks, you hear a click. Okay, so it's in there. So now you see the network starting configuring itself, but uh, we still need to get uh, inside the, the device to the Alcatel portal, um, to the website to do the configuration for the APN in order to get uh, the correct uh, APN settings into this device. So after we insert the SIM card, you see all the lights are uh, green. Uh, basically blue um, the telephone li uh, light is it's not blue because I don't have any telephone connected to this to this device yet I'm trying to configure uh, first um, and then after it's on everything is uh, you have the the Wi-Fi signal it's being bro broadcast so basically you go to the to connect to the to the device you click here you find the name here of the device, which is uh, located at the bottom here of the sticker. You have the name there of the device. Basically, you look for this name here. It's HH41, NH. But each device will have this his own uh, name and his own um, Wi-Fi keys. So basically, um, you hit connect. So it's going to ask you for the wireless key. Um, the Wi-Fi key is at the bottom here. You, you have to use it to be able to access the portal. <clears throat> it can be changed later on on the settings. So, but uh, in this case, it's uh, 0088-0369. Okay. All right. So basically we're connected. So now, the next step is going into the to access the city the the Alcatel portal. So basically, we're gonna do this. We're gonna um, open your browser and you type one nine two dot one six eight dot one dot one and click enter. Okay. So basically, here we got we got the the Alcatel Link Hub portal. So asking you for the for the login password, which is a default admin. So you're gonna type admin here. Okay. And you log into your device, right? So first thing you see here is the, we have the menu on the top. It says home, services, settings, and system. So we have to go to settings, and then we, we have to create a profile management. So we click on profile management and here we, where we created our, our APN, right now it's empty. So <clears throat> what we do is we create a new profile, right? So now we need to enter the APN settings for AT&T. So we already went to the, to the AT&T website and we get, uh, this is the uh, APN settings for different devices. This is for uh, APNs for smartphones, tablets, and smartwatches. But for this particular device, the only thing we need is this part right here. That's what we need, which is the name and the APN. So they are both the same. So we're gonna copy this one right here. <clears throat> we're going back to the Alcatel portal where we're creating the, the profile management. Basically the name of the profile will be the same as the APN. So, um, on the dial number, 
we're gonna add as a default, it's gonna be pound nine nine number. Okay, so basically we're done. We don't have to put any more information. So we we hit on the save button here. We save it. Okay, it has been created, but it's still not active. So we have to select it now here from the from the Dropbox, and we have to select the new APN. Okay, it's been selected, but now we have to set it as a default. So every time we turn off and part of this device will always come back to the set APN. So now we have to click on set default. So the device is going to get disconnected. So it's going to start configuring itself right now. Okay. So basically we go to home. We notice it's, it's disconnected. So we're going to connect back into this device. So we hit connect. So now let's see if it's uh, if we have internet. Yes, we do. Yep. So basically, it's uh, it's being confirmed that the internet is working with this device. So basically, um, I'm gonna put a link at the bottom of this video. To show you guys um, where you get your AT&T APNs and um, also the how, how to go to the to the Alcatel Alcatel portal which is this one right here which is 192.168.1.1 please um, Put a comment if you have a questions about how to how to do other other uh, companies like T-Mobile, Cricket, Metro, and um, uh, Cricket, any other any other network. It's it's compatible. This device. It just need to a little bit of uh, settings, especially APNs, in order to get the uh, the Wi-Fi and also the the phone calls uh, properly working for this device. Thank you.